Regular firmware updates for your Live U device are crucial. They bring new features, enhance performance, stability, and security. Staying updated ensures long-term support, compatibility, and optimal performance, while unlocking exciting new features for your live streaming productions. Hello, everyone, and welcome to this Live U Solo Update tutorial. If you own a Live U Solo and have been finding it difficult to update or are unaware of the latest updates, you've come to the right place. Today, we'll walk you through the process of updating your Live U Solo firmware and introduce some fantastic new features, including SRT support. Let's get started. Let's start by checking the current firmware version of your Live U Solo. Power on your Live U Solo and access the device menu. Navigate to the Unit Info section to find the firmware version. Alternatively, you can log in to your Live U portal, where the firmware version for your Live U unit can be found under the My Device Info page. Make a note of this version as it will help us determine if an update is necessary. To access the latest firmware updates for your Live U Solo, follow these steps. Go to your Live U web dashboard and click on the menu option located at the top right corner. Look for the Support section in the menu. In the search box, type Firmware Updates for Live U Solo to find all relevant information related to the latest firmware. Compare the latest firmware version displayed in the search results with the version currently installed on your Live U Solo unit. If the displayed version is newer than the one on your unit, it means there is an update available. Live U Solo firmware version 7.2.0 is now available for the following models. Live U Solo HDMI, SDI and Plus models. This firmware update includes the following features and fixes. Fix for USB hub overload issue. This update resolves the USB hub overload problem that was observed on Solo Plus units when using a total of four modems. With this fix, you can use four modems without encountering this issue. Support for additional modems. The firmware now supports the Alcatel Link E and ZTE MF833 modems, providing more modem options for your Live U Solo unit. Display issue fix. An issue has been addressed where instead of displaying the unit under remote control message, a black screen was shown. This fix ensures that the appropriate message is displayed as intended. SRT support from Live ULRT Elastic Cloud. This firmware adds support for SRT, Secure Reliable Transport, sent from the Live ULRT Elastic Cloud. Please note that this feature is pending further portal changes. Live U Solo Pro firmware version 9.7.3 is available for Live U Solo Pro models. This firmware update includes the following features and fix Huawei 325 modem support, fix for keyframe interval and frame rates, fix for diagnostic tools. Now that you have the latest firmware, let's update your Live U Solo. To upgrade your Live U unit, follow these steps start a chat on the support page. Look for a chat icon saying, Hi, need any help? Click on the icon to start a chat. Initiate chat. In the chat window, type support staff and a support assistant will join the chat to assist you. You may need to enter details like your name, email ID and then live view solo unit serial number. Request update help. In the chat, type, I need help to update my live view solo. Provide the Live U unit serial number to the support assistant when asked for. You can find the unit serial number on the back side of the unit or in your Live U dashboard where it is displayed on the unit dashboard app. The support assistant will confirm that the update has been processed from the back end, and you will receive the update over the network the next time you start your Live U solo unit. Say thanks and end the chat. Let's start updating your Live U solo to latest firmware. Once you have received confirmation from the support staff, you can begin updating your Live U Solo to the latest firmware. Before upgrading your Live U Solo to the latest firmware, there are some important considerations to keep in mind. Battery power. Ensure that your Live U unit has at least 30% battery power, or better yet, connect it to a power source during the upgrade to avoid any interruptions. Time availability. The upgrade process can take between 20 to 60 minutes, so make sure you have enough free time to complete the upgrade and test your setup afterward. Internet connection. 
your live U unit needs a stable internet connection to download the firmware. The faster the internet connection, the quicker the upgrade will be. If you're using modems for internet connectivity, be aware that it will consume some data. Switch on your Live U solo, and upon powering it on, you'll see a prompt offering you the option to upgrade to the latest version. If you are not ready to proceed with the update at that moment, you have the option to cancel it. However, if you decide to proceed, select the appropriate option on the prompt. Once you confirm the upgrade, the process will start, and you will see a screen indicating the update is in progress. It is essential to refrain from powering off or disconnecting the unit while the upgrade is taking place to ensure a smooth and successful update. During the firmware update process on your Live U Solo, the unit may automatically restart on its own. This is a normal part of the update procedure, and it helps ensure that the new firmware is applied correctly. When the unit restarts, do not be alarmed. Allow the update process to continue until it is completed entirely. It is essential not to interfere with the restart or power off the unit manually during this time, as doing so may cause issues with the update or result in incomplete installation. Always exercise patience and let the update process run its course to ensure a successful and trouble-free upgrade. Once the update is finished, your Live U Solo will be ready with the latest firmware and any new features and improvements that come with it. After the upgrade is complete, you may receive a prompt informing you of the successful upgrade. Simply click the center button on the joystick to clear the prompt. We sincerely appreciate each and every one of you for taking the time to watch this video. We hope the details about the latest firmware update have been informative and beneficial. In our next video, we're eager to delve into the enhancements brought by the SRT updates included in this firmware version. Additionally, we'll be showcasing these new features through a practical demonstration. Be sure to stay connected as we bring you more valuable insights to enhance your live U experience. Your support and interest mean a lot to us. Thank you. So, get ready to share your stories, showcase your talents, and connect with the world in a whole new way. Happy streaming and happy creating!